Hey everyone, it's Arrow Dragon. Welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5. In the last episode, we got through the Chamber of Rejection. And made it to the, I'm gonna assume it's the halfway point. And in this episode, we're gonna get started with the next chamber of Futaba's dungeon. As if she isn't as if she isn't damaged enough, let's see what the next chamber is. Um. A stone slab. When red and blue align, an illusion will rise. Only proper guidance shall form a path. Huh? What's it talking about? I haven't the slightest idea. Maybe a hint of some kind. I don't have to remember that. Anyway, this is the Chamber of Guilt. Oof. Oh. Oof, that was close. Okay, first battle. Yoink! And start the, start the episode off with two level ups. Awesome! Okay, moving on. Didn't even break a sweat. Treasure Demon? No. Treasure Demon? No. Oh. Hey, who type of shadows down there? Huh? I can't break that one. That's weird. You're late. What took so long? <laughs> uh, that's it? I've had enough to hear with her. Sorry, I was adjusting my headset. Okay. The shaking. Not again! Hey, wait! This is that. Get back! <laughs> I love the running animations out of it. That's funny. I'm sick of that stuff. What the heck is she thinking? Mm hmm. What's this? I see a treasure chest. Hmm. She seems to be a backside of a giant boulder trap. We should survey this place. Oh. That could have been it badly. That also. Uh. One more. Chest. Talk about luck. Yep, I'm already on it. Mine! A magic ointment! Oh! That will reflect a magical attack one time! That could come in handy. I know what I'm doing next time I see an Anubis. Well, then again, I don't know if it'll really work, considering I don't know who would strike. It'd be better if I had a spotlight, but I don't. What's this? The button in a slab, huh? Something visible in the slab. What do you think we should do? Let's see what the button does. Hmm, no good. Hmm. That's odd. Is it broken? Or could there be another step to this mechanism? Hmm. Uh oh. That's it. Stay right there and yoink! That was so much easier than last time. Good. Yay for Ari Matama. Okay, moving on. All right. <laughs> that was easy. Okay, a blue door. That's big. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Looks. I guess it's sealed. I have to look around. I guess we should look around. Hmm. What is over there? Hey, look, I made a bridge. I was almost pointless, but okay. What's in here? Hmm? Hey. There's some stone slab here, too, but there's nothing legible inscribed on the surface. Sounds pretty useless to me. What do I do, Joker? Hmm. Oh! Check it out! Ooh, it's shining! And the devices controlling the murals seem to react in a similar fashion. Hey, Something says B01010. That would be a clue of some sort. Either way, we should see if anything has changed. Hey, it's kind of binary. I think it's supposed to be binary. That'd be pretty. But anyway. What the? Check it out! It was a link to Stowe's slab that powers it. Indeed. It's an impressive contraption. Why don't we examine it closer? And we just heard some D01010. So, the if we look at that as binary, let's see, zero. Hey. Whoa. Turned off. I'm testing it again, Joker. I 
I see. So it's possible to turn it back on as well. Also, we should be able to turn on the holographs on or off by accessing each control panel. I think it relates to that code from earlier. Let's give it a whirl. Okay, zero, one. Zero, one. Hopefully I don't have us backward. Hopefully I don't have us backwards. Zero. I had it backwards. I thought zero meant off. Because, yeah, that's B. Oh, no, that didn't work. Actually, no, I think I, know what I, I think I know what I did wrong. I had it right the first time. I think I just have to hit the blue one. Let's see what happens if I, I, I use... I'm like, there's no control panel here. Cool, this hologram is different as well. It's blue. Might be pointing us to what we need to... You know, it sounds familiar. Uh... Maybe I just set this up and then try the and then try this again? Hey. Stop over here, Shining 2. Wasn't... Not, was not doing that earlier? Same color as the one from further in. Must be a meme in all this. Oh, okay, so I was just missing a step. Okay, the door's open. The door opened! I suppose it's the first step in this process. The next device must be beyond this point. By the way, what's up with all these things? Are they because of Utamachan's mental state? It's hard to say. But it does prove that we may not be as simple a target as we were hoping she'd be. I don't know what does it mean behind that stone slab as well. Your pad's open now. Can we just keep going? So yeah, this yeah, this dungeon is full of creative puzzles like this. Okay, what's through here? The shadows. Mm -hmm. Not getting through there, so I'm gonna have to go around. Gotcha! Alright. Okay, done and dusted. Child's These these peels. Might as well use these. And that's all I got. See it. Gotcha! All right. Yeah, unsurprisingly, having access to a psychic attack and actually realizing you have it makes stuff a lot easier to deal with. Ooh. It's a stamina sash. That's probably for HP. Yep, sure enough. I bet there's a lot of enemies using wind, using wind attacks around here after sand ban. Hmm. Is there anything else on fire? I'm sure not all these things are breakable. That's it. So what's over here? Hey. Look, a stone slab here too. Touching this will probably activate too. Do you want? What do you want to do, Jinker? I want to touch it. What else do I want to do? Yep, it's red this time. Yeah. It's lit up now, just like we were expecting. Let's see. R zero one one zero zero B one zero one one zero zero one one. So it's similar prior one. It's for these buttons. Reminds me of someone a binary. I just said that. Makes sense, given Futaba-chan's hacker background. Uh, let's go see if anything's changed. Okay, so R01100 and B100011. Yeah, if you notice, they're inverses of one another, so remembering one will let you remember the other. Okay. Check it out. Red and blue now. R01100 and B100011. So, yeah. Okay, so. 01. Okay, R's. Red 01101. B's. Right? <sighs> Give me a sec, I just I had this. 
I think it was, yeah, I was thinking it was zero one one zero zero. Let's hope I'm right. Okay, am I right? Yep, all right, looks like I'm right. Whoa, what's going on? This is a stronger reaction than anything up to this point. Guys, look! Are those giant boulders rolling down the corridor? Come on, man. Dude, they ain't stopping. This is gonna be okay. Let's push it again. Eh? Oh man, they're going faster! That only made it worse! This, do something about this Joker! Nothing's happening! <laughs> I guess kicking it really hard worked? Jeez, how many boulders are there? Did it stop? Don't tell me. What do you mean the have meant by form of path? Well, only one way to find out. Can't go that way. It's blocked off. I can see it. Okay, I was right. You can't climb on this. This just lets me. I don't know why it's finicky like that with certain objects. Whoa! Whoa! Look, talk about a mess. It's broken. Well, I guess to be a little more precise, say we broke it. Hey. What should we do? Can we, we can't get through like this. What are we gonna do? Perhaps we can walk on giant boulders. Let's try it. Huh? Nothing to lose. Uh, over here. Jump! 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 Uh... Over here, okay. Not sure why I can't just jump off the giant boulder, but okay. That was pretty cool. I actually mean when I say I like this dungeon for the puzzles it introduces. Like, that was a... OH! Okay, that, that, that came out of nowhere. I apologize for my reaction. Okay, I'm pretty sure this one might be weak to darkness, but I don't have anything that that does dark damage without killing it, so... And it's immune to fizz, strat. Um... Shoot. One time I'm caught without dark dark attacks. I could try light. It's a battle world. Nope, it is dark. I think I should just... I think I'll just off this thing. Oh, oh, well, I mean, I mean that has a chance to work. Come on, yeah, it's weak to it. Ugh. Come on, one more. Three times a charm, and no. Oh, but no, nope, I'm out of ideas. I don't have anything that can break a physical resistance. So I'm out. Of, I'm completely out of luck here. <sighs> That's that sucks. Well, at least I know what. At least I know what's weak to if, when I run into it again the mementos, and I say when and not if because I plan on because because I'll do the same thing I did with, with the one I f missed in Kanashiro's palace. So yeah, if I f so I'm out of luck with the red with the red shadows with the red shadow around here unless I can make a persona with a darkness based attack. What's over here? Huh. This end of the corridor, this didn't, didn't this didn't take nearly as long as the first one. Yeah, I'm only yeah, I'm only at about 18 minutes. This is, this is the same mechanism as the one we saw before. The guy touching big something happened. Yeah, come on, let's try it out. Okay. All right, it's kind of hard to tell though. Might be scramble as well. Let's use the controls to put it back together. Hmm. Uh, oh! Uh, oh, not quite.
There we go. It seems it's complete. Is he jumping in front of a car? Could this be the moment when Futaba's mother committed suicide? Oh. Another voice! Futaba, you are... Well, that's foreboding. At least the path is open now. She died right in front of Futaba's eyes. That's horrible. So her desire to forget those memories caused her to rest them? Yeah, Futaba, Futaba did not deserve this. She's a good child. Okay, 19. Alright, open! That was a breeze. Pretty far in now. This has to be past halfway. Yeah, treasure's definitely close. You better be excited. I'm pretty sure there's one more corridor. Hmm, I think I'll at least start it. There isn't any harm in that. I'm, you know, I'm kind of surprised I haven't needed as much SP as I've used at, at, up to this point. It's weird. Oh, well, I'm not about to complain about that. Yes. Alright. Okay. This is the Chamber of Sanctuary. I mean, that sounds nice, but it really isn't. Wow, wonderful form. Seeing such divine sculptures in person is exceedingly rare. Yeah, I guess you probably wouldn't be seeing anything like this stuff if we weren't in a palace. Seriously, this almost feels like a trip up rod or something. Hey, now's not the time to let you lay your guard down. I can sense a lot of shadows up ahead. Speaking of which, there's one right now, but it's weak. Let's see. I'm gonna head to the side of this room first. Nice. How much money do I have? I'm curious. Is that a lock chest? That's a lock chest! Alright, let's see what's inside. A dog watch kimono, a black rock, and a turquoise. Can't use use the black rock right black rock right now, but what about that dog watch kimono? Or just sleep. I mean it's better than what Makoto has right now. Did I just never give her new armor? Hmm. I mean she's doing fine up to this point, so it doesn't really matter all that much. I gotcha! <laughs> hey, yoink! Aw, oh, yeah, level up! Okay, moving on. Let's see. That's all it takes for me. Let's see what's in here. A life stone! I can use one of those right about now. That was convenient. Alright, more treasure. I'm going to be freaking rich when I get out of here. Uh, hmm. It's too quiet. I don't like this. Okay, let's see. Can't get up there. We can drop down from there, but can't get up there, so I guess we gotta go this way. Or not. We can't go that way. Oh, this is deep. What the heck is this? Not necessarily able to jump either. What should we do? Every problem. There! There is a solution. Okay. Gotta be careful, there's a shadow around the corner. Ah! Ah! Oh, rats! Knew it was too easy. Hi there! I'll need this. Okay, that's another Anubis dealt with, but it cost me a revival bead, and everyone's in really bad shape, so I need to heal. That's better. Uh, I'll use a quick Medea as well. Hi there! Okay, that's done. Let's see if we can find a way to save. Okay, that almost ended badly for me. So I gotta take the detour, and there's a shadow in this room. I have something. And it's a strong one too. Show me your so I gotta get the ambush. Yoink! Level up, nice. 
But yeah, it was just a thought that an ISIS if you could see by the splash screen, but yeah, what's this? There is an active trap, though. And now it's no longer active. Okay, I can I can I can go around. I think. Yep, that's done, so I can get this. It does crusted gear, so I can I gotta watch that. Actually, money's not gonna be an issue for for a while. Unless I unless I splurge a little too hard. What's over here? Seems like a dead end. It is a dead end. Well, that was pointless, almost. Okay, what's through here? Okay, there's a way through there, but also a way up. Go to my map. Um, I'll go up first. Yep, I made the right choice. Hey, let's push the button. Yeah! The passage is open. It seems. There's a passage hidden behind the wall. I wonder if there's a way back there. Only one way to find out. Let's keep moving. I'm hoping I can knock out the, the, this this corridor and this corridor in this episode. Hopefully I can. We'll see. Because right now I'm at 28. I feel like I can keep going. I feel it. Whoa! You know, I just realized something. I can actually show off a triple baton pass. I know I have a... Yeah, I do have a persona with, with a wind attack. Yes! So it allowed me to demonstrate the power of a triple baton pass. All you. Up, oh, we still got a live one. Oh wait, it wants- it's begging for its life. I'll take an item. A Windbreak skill card! Get out of here! I mean, the wind- a, uh, a Windbreak is entirely useful, but eh, it's a skill card at least. Okay, moving on. Now, oh, I wasn't in ambush for some reason. All right, got level up on Makoto, and I need to heal really badly. Okay. I got security decrease off that, regardless. Hmm. I should probably use this on one of my soul draw because I'm starting to dip low in SP. There we go. That should hopefully hold us over for the rest of the corridor. Uh, looking at the map. I think I'll go in here first. Yep, it's an empty room. And two bent staffs. Staves. You get my point. Uh, I don't know why some people pronounce the plural of staff as stave, like with a V. It's weird to me. I don't know. Okay, that was a bit close. Oh, jeez. Okay, hopefully this doesn't go horribly wrong. Okay, got a decent hit on it. Okay, I want to keep Nega Shogun out. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can get this thing dizzy. Yeah. Oh no, I got a crit. Ah, oh, still standing. Rat. It's another revival beat I gotta waste. Thankfully, this dungeon is full of them for some reason. And dead. Oh man. But yeah, Neko Shogun strong, strong against darkness and immune to light, so it made sense to use that to fight Anubis. Why Anubis is a chaos per persona is beyond me, though. All right. Okay, back to zero percent. Thankfully. Okay. Hopefully it's the last Anubis I gotta fight, because I'm getting really sick of uh, fighting them and praying that I don't get screwed. I need a gem. Hmm. Hmm? Look at 
the map? There's, looks like there's something below me. It's somewhere. Hmm. It's somewhere. Hmm. Where haven't I looked? Like there's like there's a gem I have to get, obviously. But the question is, where is it? Hmm. Actually, 34. I'm actually going to call the episode here. This is a safe area, so this seems like a decent place to call the episode. Next time on Let's Play Persona 5, hopefully we're going to finish the rest of the dungeon. That's all I can hope for. See you guys next time. Take care.